Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Chemical Engineering Knowledge. In this lecture, we will discuss about the relation between pressure and height in a pure zone. So, what can be the relation between pressure, which is P, and height, which is H, in the fluid? So, what will be the relation between pressure and height? How the pressure will change with height as we move in the fluid? So, as we know that pressure is nothing but it is force per unit area. We also know that force is equal to ma from Newton second law, mass and acceleration. So, we can also write in gravitational field the force is nothing but it is weight, which is the mass and acceleration due to gravity. So, in place of f, suppose this is equation number 1, this is equation number 2, and this is equation number 3. So, put equation number 2 in equation number 1. Put equation number 2 in equation number 1, we will write pressure is equal to m a divided by area. Because this is area, force per unit area. So, now we obtained equation number 4. Now, put equation number 3 in equation number 4. So, put equation 3 in equation number 4, we will get pressure is equal to mass of the fluid uh, in, pla in, pla in place for force uh, now put equation number uh, 3 this one this one put this equation number 3 in equation number 4 because this ma this ma is nothing but it is weight this ma is nothing but it is weight so, in place of MA, we will write MG. In gravitational field, the A simply, this, this A will convert it to G. Acceleration due to gravity. G, and this is the area. So, this is equation number 5. Now, we know a relation between density and mass. So, density is nothing but mass per unit volume. So, mass can be written as density into volume. Density into volume. So, Equation number 5 can be further written is 5 can be further written is P in place of this mass we will write this relation density into volume density into volume of the fluid and acceleration due to gravity into the area and we know that volume divided by area is nothing but height so volume is for example volume is cubic meter and area is meter square so this cancel with this meter and it is the unit of height. So we can further write this volume divided by area is nothing but height. So from this relation we know that P is equal to rho G and H. And this is the relation which show us the relationship between pressure of the fluid with height. Usually this G, D is constant, this is the rho is constant, the density of the liquid is constant, G is usually constant, the unit of G is 9.8 meter per second square, acceleration, uh, uh, gravity, gravitational acce acceleration, and the density of water is usually given, 1000 kilogram per cubic meter. So, uh, from this relation, we will determine that uh, pressure is uh, directly proportional to height. So, as we uh, increase the height, the pressure will be increased. So, as we increase the height, the pressure will be increases from this relationship. So, the pressure increases with the height, right? P is equal to rho g h. This is constant, this is given to us, this is also given to us, this is unknown to us, this is h. So, as we increase h, the pressure will be increases like simply like this one. Like this one. Take a container, fill it with some liquid water, fill it with some liquid water, fill it with some liquid water. Now make a hole in this place, one hole, another in this, another in three, make three holes. So, the, uh, this is the height, this is the height. So, uh, so the water will come out from this, uh, another water will come out from this, and 
the other rotor will become a calm yes so the pressure of we check the pressure of this water that will be very high the pressure of this water will be very high the pressure of this water will be slightly the pressure of this water will be slightly low and the pressure of this water will be very low so as we is from this we uh, conclude conclude that as the height increases as the height increases in this direction as the height increases in this direction the pressure also increases also the pressure in this place is very high pressure of liquid uh, at this point is very very large and the pressure at this point is slightly less and the pressure pressure at this point is quite very less from the above two pressures so from this we conclude that as we increase the height of the liquid the pressure of the fluid increases over because the weight uh, because as we go down in the liquid the weight of the fluid as we go down because when we go down uh, when we go down in the fluid when we go down in the fluid the weight of the fluid the weight of the fluid on the below fluid will be increases over so the weight of fluid increases as we go down in the fluid due to this weight the pressure of the fluid at the base will be very high as compared to the pressure at the top of the container in inside this container so this was just a relationship uh, between height and pressure thank you very much for your attention if you are new to the channel please like and subscribe to my channel